I'm gonna be showing you five ways to make an app for free without coding. And at the end, I'm gonna show you the step-by-step -step process I use to sell my ideas and my apps. Here are the five platforms. Number one, Softer. Number two, Flutterflow. Number three, AppGyver. Number four, BuildBox. Number five, Bubble. All of these platforms allow you to start for free. Now, wait a minute, some of you might say, but some of their plans, you have to pay money. Well, yeah, when you advance or have more functionality, you will have to pay money with most of these platforms. But to begin, all five of these platforms, you can start for free. And that enables you to validate your idea, see if anyone even wants your idea, and then be able to scale from there. We're gonna be going through key features of all of these five platforms in a moment, but I want you to think about what functionality do you need and why? Not just, I would love to have every kind of feature, every platform has pros and cons. No matter what you go through, if you're looking at Bubble, AppGyver, the list goes on, what you're going to see is all of them are special in different ways. First, we're gonna take a look at Softer. Softer is a platform where you can create custom apps for your business and it's easy to start in just a few moments. You can create client portals, marketplaces, mobile apps, internal tools, online communities, resource directories, and websites. It's important to note they just added mobile apps. This is really huge, so there's Softer Mobile here. So you can turn your Softer web app into a mobile app with just one click. So immediately you can make it available on Apple and Android devices with no extra resources needed. That's huge. This has already been one of my favorite platforms, but now that you can be able to turn this into a PWA, a progressive web app, it brings it up another level again. Next up, we have Flutterflow. This allows you to build your apps very easily and fast, and this is an option if you're looking for a low-code or no-code solution. Some of the features include animations, push notifications, light and dark mode, and also chat features. Also, Flutterflow is a platform that a company used to raise more than $23 million for their on-demand marketplace for electric vehicles. If you want to know more or if you want us to do a breakdown, make sure that you let us know in the comment section down below and there's going to be a link to see that article of how they raised the money. That's huge. So if you're looking at what's the potential of no code or low code, there are legitimate businesses raising tons of money using this platform. Next, we have AppGyver. You can build apps, including mobile, desktop, TV, and other apps, all from one platform. This is a really popular solution that a lot of people wanna use because it's totally free. To start to finish, it doesn't matter how you scale it, it can be free, but there is a catch with that. Although you can submit this to the store, you know, the iOS or the Android, you know, the Google Play Store, any of those things, you do not have access to a database for free. You have to use Xano or Backendless now with AppGyver. They changed that about a year ago. What does that mean? Depending on what database you use, it's not really that free, right? You're going to want to save data from your user. Every Essentially, every app is going to need to save data, which means you're going to have a database. At this time, AppGyver does not offer their own database. You're going to have to use third party. So guess what? still gonna be a price to you. The downside of AppGyver though is they don't have templates that you can use like Softer, Flutterflow, and the list goes on and on. You're gonna to have to build it from scratch. So you're going to have to either build it with Figma in the design and then mimic the design when you bring it into AppGyver. There's just something to consider. Although it's free and it can be cheap to a point, you've gotta do a lot of legwork as well. Next, we have BuildBox. This is a specialty platform. If you're trying to create a game with no code, this is the platform to go with. You can create 2D or 3D games, and you can be doing that with BuildBox. It has its own game engine, and this is really for a niche. A lot of people ask me, how can I do card games or other things? For the most part, I'm gonna say just use BuildBox. The next option is Bubble. Bubble allows you to build just about anything, and it's it's hugely popular in the no-code community. People are building micro SaaS, software as a service, and just tons of great things in no-code. The learning curve is pretty steep getting used to Bubble. I bring that up because if you need to validate your idea, how long will that take you to learn and validate your idea? Versus if you use something like Softer, how quickly can you get started, see if people want it, see if people are willing to pay, and then decide if you wanna scale or go with another platform. 
In the comment section down below, which platform would you choose and why? This is really important that we talk about before you even start building because you don't want to spend time going down just the cheapest option where you can use tons of these no-code platforms on the free tier, validate your idea, and then see if it's right for you to start building. After deciding which platform you want to use and what features match your goals, it's important to get started and test your audience. Go and talk to people about what you're trying to build and get buy-in. If you're looking for beginner guides of these different platforms, there are tons of videos on this channel where we go through softer for beginners, AppGyver for beginners. Take a look at those and start building and asking your audience what you want to do first. If you have any questions, make sure in the comment section down below, let us know. And if you want to hear more business ideas regarding building apps, there's going to be a link down below to get 50 plus side hustles that are highly profitable.